We're now going to look at the seven data types within Access. Auto number, text field, memo, number, date and time, currency, and a yes, no. The auto number field is primarily used to identify records, usually as the key field. The majority is set to long integer, the default, and the increments option in new values sets new values to be one higher than the last one used. A text field is a fixed length field. The field size is currently set to 255, default from access to 2007, but it can be set to any number you like. A gender field, for example, would have a field length of one. A memo field is very similar to a text field. The only major difference being is that it is unlimited in length. Very useful for storing notes about people. A number field. The default being long integer, just as auto number was. Different formats can be set, and if decimals are appropriate, which in this case they're not, the auto function within decimal places will set that to an appropriate value. Date and time, used to store, date and time, either one or the other or both. Different formats can be set from a drop down here. For the purpose of this project, we'd be using short date. Currency is used to store monetary values, and for the most part, we'll set its decimal places to be two. And a yes no field appears in the form of a tick box a tick meaning yes, no tick meaning no, the only two options it can hold. <laughs> 